everyone. So, today's a pretty exciting day. Today, I'm going to the Fresno State State of the Union, and then, later on in the day, Horn Photo has their Panasonic event, and I'm just really looking forward to that because I can get my hands on the GH5. Anyways, let's get this day started. So we're heading into the State of the Union. It'll be a good time. See you guys in just a bit. So the event was pretty cool. It was good. I enjoyed it. Um, those things are pretty easy. You know, this is what we did last year. This is what we're gonna do this year. Thank you for your money. God bless. Good night. I I like them. In and out on the road. Here it is. All. So I'm gonna finish out the work day, hit the Panasonic event at Horde Photo. Hopefully you could do that on the lunch. <clears throat> All right, so we made it to the Horn Photo event or the, the Panasonic event at Horn Photo. So I'm gonna go check it out. I brought my SD card. I brought my SD card. I'm hoping that they'll let me slide this thing in there. That way I can capture capture some footage, show you guys what that looks like compared to the front facing camera of my iPhone. So hopefully they let us do it. So yeah, let's go check it out. So the GH5 footage that I had is not working. It's corrupt. I was going to show actual footage from the camera that I got when I got my hands on it at Horn Photo. However, that's not that's a no go. So instead. I'll give you guys just my impressions here now. So overall with my hands on with the camera, I really, really loved it. The weight of it was really good. The camera body itself was great. I love the folding out LCD screen. Obviously that's gonna be great for vloggers or it's just great for those who do video by themselves and they don't really have anyone helping them record. That's also going to be great. The autofocus was great as I was zooming in and out with the lens that I was using with my hands on. And again, I mean, this is a mirrorless camera, so it's not too surprising on the weight and how it felt. Um, one thing I was curious about was more was more so battery life and how long it would last. But um, I obviously, I didn't get to test that out. So my goal is to actually rent one and take it through a full day of using it and vlogging with it and uh, seeing, seeing how it goes. So definitely stay tuned to see if we can get that done. Um, but yeah, overall, um, the initial hands-on really enjoyed my time with it. So, I was at work a lot longer than I expected to be, but it's all right, I'm out now. I'm gonna hit the gym real quick, then hit, pick up the baby girl and call this day over. I'm, I was really feeling the Panasonic GH5, that thing was, that was nice. That was a good camera. But man, that thing is pricey. 2000 not including the lens. The lens was a wide angle and that thing was like $1,100. Putting you at like three grand. Way out of the price range, seeing as how I'm still rocking this iPhone. Let's get this gym day started now. And then pick up, pick up my baby girl from the dance studio. Out was great here at the dance studio picking up the care package and then uh, yeah home we go I got the package look it's right here it's in my bed bez I don't think they can see it's too dark it's all right hold on we're gonna go into the light right now hold on people hold on there's no light boom boom there's boom no light that's enough. Well, there's light up there. Got her. We got her. There she is right there. We got the package. Mm -hmm. 